This is a quick look at the Ganzo Firebird FB760 purchased from Gearbest. This is what I would consider a medium sized EDC. It's, uh, I'll tell you right off the bat, it's probably one of my favorite fidgety knives to play with. It's uh, running on ball bearing washers and it is very smooth deployment as most other people have mentioned it just kind of dangles when you pull back the axis lock the action on this knife is really quite fun in addition to being fun to play with this knife is actually built quite well as well the blade when deployed has rock solid lock up up down left to right this is from the factory I haven't played with the pivot uh, the axis lock works really nicely the minute you pull it back it just drops right down ambidextrous thumb studs so deploying left or right hand it just works well G10 handles on this the variety I got this comes in at least five different varieties I got the digital camo with the black coated blade now on the website if you look at their knife on display for this model the handle scale look different because of the digital camouflage you'll never get to exactly the same so this is how mine's looks it has a little more white on the presentation side on the pocket clip slide it has a little more darker colors so it just is what it is it's kinda like Damascus in that you'll never get two that are exactly the same for the digital camo anyways uh, this knife when closed you'll see that it has perfect centering and there is jimping at the top of the handle which is purposeful there is minor jimping in this back spacer um, it doesn't really do much because it's not elevated past the scales and the liners there's a lanyard hole for the attachment of a lanyard if you choose to do so there is a loop over pocket clip which is for very deep carry and the retention is good not too tight and not too obnoxious when you're holding it there are no hot spots when holding this knife in the hand for me personally the edges are camfered so it's very comfy in the hand when in use everything is disassembled via Torx bits and you'll need two to adjust the pivot this has once deployed a very nice skeletonization in the scales or the liners I should say which reduces the weight significantly keeping this knife very light for its capacity and capabilities the knife shape blade is a drop point with a swedge up top and it's a very utilitarian shape nice curvature belly good for slicing and just everyday task there are etchings there imprints of the model if you're interested you likely can see it here there's not much printing which I personally like Firebird logo as you can see there in hand when this is open it's very comfy uh, the finger troll is not too prominent but it still holds the hand well in place with the jimping up top jimping on the blade which does work and these little cutouts at the base of the handle which also provide a decent amount of grip when your fingers land on them so overall this knife ergonomically is very good there is a sharpeners troll as you can see there 
and overall I would recommend this knife highly it's probably my favorite Gonzo at the moment I likely will get some more in the future in probably either a full black or the green handle scale to add to the collection and now I'll just show it in comparison to another popular Gonzo Firebird this one here which is the Gonzo F761 so as you can see this one's a lot more lower profile and narrow both have blue anodized hardware which is a nice accent blade stock length handle thickness and handle shape and size yeah it's a very nice knife pocket clip is probably the the only thing that I would improve on for this knife just simply because you can only have it tip up right hand carry so that excludes a lot of people that would prefer it in all four orientations personally this is my preferred orientation so it's ideal for me but it would be nice if it, they would cater to everybody but I'm not complaining at this price for this quality highly recommended ball bearing pivots smooth action I would give this knife probably a 9 out of 10. Highly recommended. Thank you for watching. Until next time.